Right, so it's just a quick video about something I've made over the weekend. I suppose you'd call it an ornamental mouse trap. It's a working model, but it's probably too nice to use really. So I wanted to just try and make something, you know, a bit nicer, put a fair bit of effort into it, rather than just, you know, nailing wood together. So I found as many kind of different bits of wood I could get. What I had laying around, you know, nice bits of wood. I made this little mouse trap. And like I said, I tried to put as much effort as I could. I've even lined the holes, the front two are lined with brass, the back one is lined with um, aluminium aluminium trigger twisted brass wire noose spring at the back there so I tried to put as much wood different wood as I could I even put a nice felt bottom on it and if you just tip it slightly forward and then press that down that locks in there that's the front and then it would work you could change the trigger around to either way but this one would work bait at the back and then the mouse would push its way in and then get caught brass tube as the pivot there locks on perfectly just sometimes you don't need to um, lean it forward but it's better it works better lean it slightly forward so I'd made it by the first thing I did I kind of just made it made it up as I went along so the first thing I did was got these bits and epoxied them together and I'd made a small kind of checkerboard kind of bit there epoxied all that together and then kind of put them in place um, I did it all by hand the only bit I didn't do by hand was drilling holes so um, it's all hand sanding, hand plane in the wood cutting with hand saws sanding and finishing but I think that's come out pretty decent that bolt there at the back you know, I'm quite happy with that came out something different like I said more of a display piece than anything else right anyway um, that's pretty much it. Cheers for watching. I'll see you later.